السلام عليكم now and after we take for uh, lead uh, to be uh, stable not flickering we will go to PC programming first we connect LAN port of the PPX to the LAN port of the PC and we will go to Chrome browser and we will write the default IP now we are connected to the VPX asking for username which is which must be uh, installer with capital letter for the first time password is one two three four again first welcome screen asking about interface uh, languages and about area code here we are uh, in Egypt and you must re-enter to select a new password and start setup wizard asking about time it's, take, it's taken from PC directly and it's right so going to next screen asking about uh, what type of numbering we uh, prefer to use with star or without star we will leave it with star uh, by default uh, access uh, for outside line was zero and operator was nine thus we find we we uh, uh, trying to uh, dial from the telephones for, for the first time now uh, as we here in Egypt uh, usually use 9 for civil line access and 0 for operator I change it asking about number of digits 3 digit or 4 digit 3 digit starting with 101 or from 201 and also asking for the another type of 4 digit numbering we will leave it added manager extension can be changed can use any number any extension number as a manager and any extension number as an operator again we leave it as it trunk lines was assigned to DTMF dialing by default PRI 30E1 card when installed which type of function will be used as an E1 card or PRI 30 card 30 channel card the same card as we mentioned before here we decide which function will be used E1 or PRI 30 again we leave it as default uh, it's not recommended recommended to uh, use common call distribution group it will make uh, all extension receive ring uh, because uh, DIL destination in uh, this case will be uh, in common call distribution group number one for CO line one two for CO line two and so on all of extension the system are members in all of these coming call distribution groups so all the system will ring if we select yes so please leave it no about LAN addresses this is the default uh, IP address if your LAN 
uh, does not match this uh, IP address, please change it. If you have a uh, domain name server, so you can adjust all of this networking, but you must uh, arrange this with IT manager of uh, the location. Next, we must set this for four, because I have four IPBT free activated permanent. So it's better to make it four for to connect them under condition of installing DSB card in the main unit. If you don't install DSB card, you will not, uh, you cannot use these IP phones. Finish, we will pressing finish we will start to program the system and we will see the program now now our system we have a basic 16 single line telephone card and we, ins we install additional one so we have 32 single line telephone extension with the maximum allowed single line telephone to be connected with a main unit a Panasonic NS500 main unit as you can see for interactive programming we have this green lid which indicates that the main unit is working and we have interactive programming now Looking to our system, we have important uh, steps we must go and see. First of all, we will go to extension and see the wired extension and look for extension setting. Extension setting indicates for the four digital property telephone port which is 101 and 102 and can be expanded with digital uh, central device ports as we uh, see in the previous, previous video so numbering 101 102 is for uh, digital phones and 103 and 104 is for its etc device ports single line telephone will start numbering from 105 as you can see we have 32 extension but this screen give 20 elements we can choose to see 60 so we can see all extensions here after the 32 single line telephone we will find virtual IP extensions if we install our free activated for IP phone they will take these numbers and they work again we must remember to install DSP or digital signal processing card to have this 4IB phone which is free activated forever to be worked for another IB phone connection just plug the phone into LAN port under condition of getting activation key match the number of IB phone you want to install or to use Getting back to a single line telephone extension setting screen, we can figure out that each extension number have a class of service number and this number couldn't be cancelled. 
each extension must have class of service number and cannot be cancelled also user group and cannot be cancelled class of service will be will decide all the permitted and denied features to this extension which is belong to that class of service Uh, so the important element in uh, extension setting is user group and class of service we will see how it will affect the extension operation uh, here we can change uh, extension number as we can but under a condition of uh, respecting the number plan numbering plan numbering plan is an element of system programming uh, as a trial if i want to put 550 as an extension number for extension number one same extension number already exists so the first condition in changing extension number first is to give a free number for the extension if you insist to give this number to that to this extension you must go first to this number where it is and change it or cancel it so you freeze the number then reuse it 550 is a number of OGM it's an OGM Chan. it's a uh, message uh, see optional devices voice message Deezer message we find that we have message number one take number 501 and so on as we have 64 message so numbering will be from 501 to 564 as you can see number 50 550 is here which i want to use as an extension number first i must cancel it or put another number as the last number is 564 you can put 565 here apply okay then turn me back to extension wired extension and put 550 here and see what we will get apply it's okay first rule is to respect numbering plan second if you uh, choose a number which is used in another extension or feature you must go and change it or or cancel it if you want 102 to be 124 this is used number here we cannot use it before release it from here so giving this number here and go up and put 124 it's okay if you are asked to uh, re number extension uh, with uh, different numbers it's uh, it's okay but you must first match numbering plan let us see what is going on on numbering plan to keep in mind what we have when we discuss how to change numbers 
Um, so I must say, I must tell you how I go to this screen. First, I must go to system number two. Then, I have number six numbering plan. First one, which is mean numbering. Here we can see that we have number one, two, three, four used for extension number. Also five, also six. Six will be found in incoming call distribution group. We have 64 incoming call distribution group. They take numbers from 601 to 664. As we see a message, it takes from 501 to 564. Number 500 itself is taken for voicemail port. So, as you can notice, we can use numbering from 100 to 199. XX means that you can put any number beside number 1, starting from 0 to 9. So, I have a numbering plan starting from 100 to 199. 200 to 299 and so on. If I ask it to make it four digit numbering, I must come here, come to this screen and try to put number one. Okay. Apply, it's okay, no problem. So this means that I have 4100 to 4199. Adding one beside number four give me the ability to do this for two, for three, for four, for five, and so on. So you can see now what a huge amount of numbers you have to be selected or used in extension numbering. It's flexible, it's easy. Just regard what you have in numbering plan three and expect this number, try to change it and use it. This is numbering plan. <coughs> now we will go to class of service and see what's class of service. Class of service is a number which put side every extension number indicates what features will be permitted and denied to this extension. So we must have a deep look to class of service setting. It's a three parameter class of service, general setting, external call block also internal call block which means that i can control which telephone talk to which telephone as an intercom talk or intercom call or intercom connection this is very important especially in hotel applications and we will explain it and we uh, want this feature to be very clear for everyone programming or installing a PPX system for its importance. External call blocking is also important. Let us see first what we can do with external call block. External call block. We have 64 trunk group to which our CO lines will belong to because each CO line uh, we have must belong to a trunk group. We will see this idea when 
we come here but people who is familiar with pbx programming is knowing what is the meaning of trunk group trunk group is a collection of co lines uh, trunk group page will control the behavior of all of the co lines which belong to that uh, trunk group so we have 64 trunk group so permission or blocking using of external co line is based on trunk group connection or uh, trunk group basis class of service one if i need it's now it's blocked means that people or extension who will belong to class of service number one cannot use trunk group number one or two or three they can use four five no this is my selection look at what i am doing and read for the first 16 trunk group people who will belong to class of service number one cannot access trunk group number one or three or four so you can access four seven eleven we can change it easily we can make it leave it as we can but what we will do here will affect the extension which belong to that class of service so in class of service external call block we will decide which extension will use this trunk group which will be permitted which should be denied from using this trunk group on a class of service programming basis or basis here in external call block we decide the permission or denying of accessing the trunk group but of course if you want uh, this class of service rakam one uh, number one <laughs> sorry i'm using an arabic words number one to use trunk group number eight we will open it if the situation that i am want them to use only this trunk group it's okay but i want them to use this trunk group but without international calling so people who will belong to class of service one in their extension setting have only one trunk group to be used under restriction of not using international call this will be done using class of service setting because i have a tour restriction level in day and lunch and break and night each class of service has four levels at four time shifts of working and another tour selection level when it is locked everyone can lock his extension before leaving the disk and he the this number will decide the situation of the extension which is locked so for people who will have class of service one who access trunk group number eight must be restricted from calling international call so we must have another place to put this restriction of course we have another place it's the total selection deny it code number seven to selection deny it code so
tonight code is set according to level so level one is not restricted at all class of service is level to restriction level one means that they can do everything they can dial everything denying will start with level two if i put zero zero here this means that people who will have level two they will be denied of zero zero tiling going back I'm coming back or coming back to class of service setting set this that is level 2 means that class of service 1 has a tour restriction level 2 in day and lunch and break and night this means that they can not dial calls starting with zero zero as we can see in torus selection level table Also, you can add another codes if you want to extract them from call zero zero, and another code is okay, it's no problem. You can go to level three and set zero in general and apply. This this means that who will have level three will not dial any number starting with zero getting back to class of service setting going to tour selection level and launch if we put three this means that people who will have class of service number one In the day shift they can't dial numbers starting with zero zero during lunch they cannot dial any number starting with zero in general in break we can make it uh, much difficult we can prevent them from dialing any number this is a brief and fast description uh, for PC programming for Panasonic KXN S500 it will be followed by another demonstration but we uh, will prefer to have our uh, video shorter uh, as you can see you again